The degree of flexibility goes up dramatically when you utilize a machine like the ATC. My name is Tom Bosco. I'm the plant manager with Trox USA. Trox is a family-owned business. It started in 1951 by Heinrich Trox. Trox USA is a manufacturer of commercial HVAC equipment, mostly in high-rise buildings that would be for office space or for on-campus, either classroom or dormitory type applications. All of our orders are basically built to order. It's all custom work. It's not built to stock. Our attempt to reduce costs and keep production working in an even flow, we have gone away from batch production and trying to go to single piece flow production. Flexibility is very important to us in, um, in terms of running production. The sheet metal area has been one of the key areas because that's always been the bottleneck. It's the pacing item for the plant. If we don't get the sheet metal produced, we can't do any other operation. Trox's production system is focused around lean manufacturing principles and manufacturing parts that support their goals of cost, quality, and delivery. Tom Bosco discusses the issues that contributed to the bottleneck within the sheet metal department. We found it more and more difficult as time went on to find qualified people to run our sheet metal department. That was one of the major issues or hurdles we had. The other was our, just our capacity. We filled capacity with some used equipment, more people, but then we find that things are still trying to speed up. So we recognize because of our lean effort that our setup time within the press break area was one of the issues that if we could save time there, we could certainly improve our throughput right through the sheet metal department. Because of the need to double production and to do it without increasing staff, Trox looked at technology to help solve these issues. They felt that technology and equipment is where they would gain the most. We went into an investigation to look at equipment specifically that could address the changeover time. What we found at the market at the time was Amada had the ATC product line that would meld easily into what we were doing today and in the future. With the ATC, we identified early on is that the changeover process could be two and a half to three minutes. The degree of flexibility goes up dramatically when you utilize a machine like the ATC. When you integrate it with the software that Amata offers, the pre-engineering size of forming can be completed before the process, so now things become even quicker with information. It's when we say we want to run that part, we run that part, we get the outcome that we expect, and that's a quality part. When we did our initial evaluation, it was supported by what Amada did for us in terms of analysis. We saw a payback with growth of the company probably in less than two years. When you start looking at 20 minutes, changeover times versus two or three minutes, that adds up quick. Not only our changeover time has gone down, but our cycle times have improved. Trox also noticed the additional benefits that the HGATC brought to its staff these intangible things that you don't necessarily see, the satisfaction of the operator and the confidence the operator has in the machine. Joel Gatewood, lead in the press break department, talks about the ease of use and accessibility of the AMNC 3i control. The touch screen is a lot easier than the ones that we've used in the past. You bring a new person in and you're training them, if they forget where they're at and they can see the 3D on each step, they can look at it and it tells them what to do. It does take a lot of the skill level that you have to have to run it out of it. It makes your life a lot easier. Chris Carson, engineering manager, discusses the advantages of offline programming with Amada's Dr. Abe Ben software. When the ATC came along, uh, we looked at basically being able to set up our programs offline in engineering, and then once that program is set in stone, that's the way we run. So we, we're looking for standardization and consistency with quality on all of our parts. You can really look for things at the programming side and see problems there, and then if you need to go back to the design side of the part and make changes, you can do that now at that beginning part of the process rather than having this part sitting out there on the floor and all of a sudden you got a problem and you can't form it because of the collision with the machine or with tooling. The major advantage with this software is that you can look at all your parts, let's say you're going to run for production for the day, 
and you can schedule all those. And what that software will do is go in there and look at a like setups and it will tell you, you need to run these parts in this order to gain the most efficiency out of that machine for the day. Innovative and reliable technology is not the only benefit that Trox has experienced with Amata. Over time, we recognize the value to Amata not only in terms of reliability, but also service. We get the response that we expect, even though we may be a small customer, we're treated like a large customer. What does the future for Trox look like? Our product lines will be expanding here in the next two to three years. We expect it to be about four times the size we are by 2020. The wheels are in motion for that to happen. We'll need more equipment that do automatic tool changes. We'll need to expand to fiber laser technology, maybe combination punch laser, but that's where we'll grow to. I think we're on a path to continue our relationship with Mata.